and so I just took my unboxing knife to this bad boy and now I'm ripping off the plastic and now it's going to lift off the top lid. It's going to lift this iPhone 5S out of the box. I'm going to take a look at the contents of the box. Jens Bremica is a huge fan of unboxing. The games reviewer loves watching other people unpack electronics. Whether smartphones or computer games, this Berliner is mesmerized by unpacking. When I'm watching unboxing videos, then I unpack along with them in my head and imagine being that person ripping open the packet, pulling out the gadget and inhaling that new product smell. That's the feeling you get when you watch a good unboxing video. Mirko Drescher is a director in his spare time. The Berlin drinks distributor makes unboxing videos for fun. Then he uploads them to his own YouTube channel. Das neue Alucap von Just Mobile. Das Alucap ist aus Aluminium gestaltet und äh, aus einem Guss. Mirko Drescher would love to make money with his unboxing videos. The 36-year-old thinks the genre serves a purpose. I like to give people a feel for whether the product offers value for money and to show what the product can do. I help customers make purchasing decisions and show why you should buy the product. I am here to unbox with you the new Nokia E61. American Vincent Noyen in the very first unboxing video made in 2006. As you can see it's very thin. Noyen came up with the term unboxing. At first, there was little interest in his idea, but then the unboxing craze took off online. These days, people are making more and more unboxing videos, and the most popular ones are getting millions of clicks. That's got scientists talking. Sociologist Andrei Novakovsky from Berlin's Free University has started studying unboxing with a research team. We think there's a type of hedonism involved. There's a vicarious thrill. This is a product I can't have right now and can't unpack. So that's why I watch other people unpacking it. Unpacking also prompts happy childhood memories for many users. They remember unwrapping Christmas presents as a child or receiving birthday presents. Some say unboxing is all about nostalgia for days long past. These days I still love unpacking something new. But I don't get Lego castles for Christmas anymore. Watching unboxing videos helps you keep that feeling alive. And now, companies have even started producing their own professional unboxing for advertising purposes. This is one internet craze that suits them to a T. After all, unboxers love shiny packages and expensive products. Milko Drescher says that's legitimate. So for instance, this is a cheap gadget. The packaging is really thin, it's cheap. And this is an expensive Apple peripheral from Just Mobile. You can tell that you're buying a good product from the packaging in the outside. And I think you're really drawn to it. But not everyone's a fan of unboxing. The craze has spawned parody videos online. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's a PlayStation 4! Others go even further. Some cyber activists want this trend to end. They think unboxing videos are shallow. Wow. There you go. Critics say unboxers have it all wrong. They should focus on function, not form. Shift says, much ado about nothing. Oh.